Hey boys, what's poppin? It's Amber here with a really simple tutorial on how to change your language to Korean in League of Legends this season 10. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So with season 10 starting a day ago, I've decided to make this compilation of videos on how to change your language in League of Legends. They are the latest guys you can find here. I'm basically doing this for three main languages people are looking for, which is Korean, Japanese, and Chinese. This is going to be the Korean version, so how to change your language to Korean. Next video will be how to change your language to Chinese. And then afterwards, tomorrow, I'll upload the same thing for the Chinese. This is all latest, so without further ado, do let's get started okay so here we are on the desktop first things first what i want to do is start my league of legends just to show you guys my launcher um it's nothing really special just a default launcher as you can see here i'm playing on the us uh, these are the languages we can have of course i'm playing on english by default um season 10 that's basically it so what we're gonna do is go ahead and turn this into korean launcher um just a little question most of you guys will have is whether you can get korean voices only and the answer is no uh you can only get the entire launcher korean and that's about it first things first we're gonna locate our riot games directory the way you'll do that is by right clicking on your league of legends icon click properties open file location here and uh click on riot games right here and league of legends that should be it if you don't have league of legends icon on your desktop for some reason you're gonna open the explorer uh go to my computer local disk c usually that's where uh it is uh riot games uh league of legends and there you go um do not click on riot client this is where it will send you in the beginning even if you open file location from a uh, icon just do not go here there's nothing to do here um, you're gonna go in League of Legends. You're gonna find leeclient.exe. Uh, it's an application. You're gonna uh, create shortcut. You're gonna take this, drag it, whatever you want. I'll do it on the desktop. This is the shortcut you wanna use to change your language. What you wanna do is right click on it, click on properties. Um, here we have the target box. You're gonna go all the way to the right, uh, make a space, two lines, locale equals uh ko underscore kr capital you're gonna click on apply okay we're gonna start lead client shortcut you can rename it by the way just use this shortcut for uh launching the korean client i'm also going to show you how to go back so do not worry here we have everything in korean i'm gonna just log in real quick And as you guys can see, that will be it. Uh, the Korean client is on. We're just gonna wait for the update to finish. You should be getting an update. Uh, what this means is that the client is downloading all the voices, sounds, announcer packs, and so on. For those who do not know how to go back, I'm gonna show you right after the client is done updating. So let's just wait for that. <coughs> Okay, so a few hours passed, as you guys can see. Um, I'm whispering because my girlfriend fell asleep, so it's a bit of um, an ASMR video right now. That's kind of weird, but yeah, we're going with that. Um, there you go. The play button is uh, the play button is available, as you can see. Um, we can play whatever. There's a little bit of a bug here. Um, some text isn't changed. Some text is. Um, that's a new issue with this new client um, ever since it has been released it, it was kind of buggy but um, there you go you can do whatever you want you can play um, I believe there's no need for me to go into a custom game and show you guys that everything is indeed Korean now I'm going to show you how to switch it back to English so we're gonna go ahead and close our launcher uh, we're gonna sign out as well what you want to do is delete the lead client you made the shortcut you want to practically do the same thing. I'm sorry again for whispering. I literally have no choice. This might be creepy, but yeah. You want to take lead client. You want to create a shortcut again. You want to put that out on the desktop. Right click properties. We're going to use this code. I'm going to post both of the codes in the description. So do not worry. Locale um, equals EN underscore JP apply okay 
if that was English. However, if you were using any other language prior to change than English, uh, you can find the code of your language um, and you can just type that code instead. So here we have username, password, everything is fine, um, English again. And that's about it guys, I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial. Next up there is a Chinese video, so how to change your language to Chinese. So if you're interested, stay tuned for that. Um, wishing you much love and peace during the holiday season. Even though all holidays passed, but it's okay. It's still winter, so we, we chillin'. Um, so yeah, bye.